Hi there, everyone. Nice to have you along with us once again. We're at the Riverside Stadium. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. We have Premier League action for you coming right up. Middlesbrough against Arsenal. Well, I think the first ten minutes might tell us how this match is going to pan out. Who can gain the upper hand? Who can get hold of this ball and ask all the questions? Well, he really could be the star of the show today. Well, his league form has been outstanding. And it's not just the goals, and there have been plenty of them. It's the movement off the ball. So difficult to track. And this is the 11 that will take the field for Middlesbrough. Well, we put it up as a 5-2-3. It could be 3-4-3, three, three, couldn't it, if the wide players get forward from the back? Yeah, I think it's one of those. It could be anything the manager wants it to be. He has got some very talented lads out there, though. Here's the Arsenal team. Three changes today. Ben Leno starts in goal. Callum Chambers starts alongside Jose Maria Jimenez. In the heart of defence, Rassam Ben Yedda is the main striker today. Thank you. Enjoy the game. Well, this should be a great game, and we're off and running. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Well, that was disappointing. They could have made more of it. Some of the fans there thinking that should be a corner, but it's a throw. Lewis. Well, he has cleared the danger. It's going to be very tough for the opposition today to break down the home team's defence. When you look at the stats, very few teams have broken them down. Fletcher! Not really tested the goalkeeper, but sometimes it can look a bit too easy. He made sure he made the save competently. Yeah, he did, and he doesn't make too many mistakes, this lad. Well, they couldn't keep possession. They've given it away. A lot of the talk from the pre-match press conferences has been about Socrates. He has said, Alan, that he's going to pack the game in, that this will be his last season. Clever ball. Won it back with an interception. That's an important clearance. Armstrong. Lovely ball. In with a chance. Comes out off the goalkeeper. Well, they have cleared the danger. It was a decent opportunity, I think. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Well, when you're on top, you've got to make it count, and the fans sense that, and they're urging the players to do that. A penalty at Bournemouth. It's a penalty for Bournemouth. Opening them up with a through pass. The referee has pointed for the penalty. Or oh, could be a big, big moment in this match. Penalty given, Alan, but no sign of a card. No, I think that's fair enough. I think penalty award is perhaps punishment enough. Oh, he's put it wide. Oh, my word, he's gone for the corner, but missed it by a little distance there. Well, that is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that. First goal of the contest, it's gone to Arsenal. Goal came about after a really good move too. So to confirm, Arsenal are ahead. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Ben Yedda. Ndidi. They get it away. We're hearing about a goal at the Vitality Stadium. Alan Canale. It's a goal for Leicester City. 30 minutes played, 1-1. Top work, Alan. 
We're back here now with Alan Smith. One or two options now in forward areas for them. And it's Fletcher. It could be a chance. Goalkeeper can only parry it out. Safety first from the defender. Can't blame him for that. Well, space to get the cross in. To get the equaliser. And it's in, the equaliser. Well, it was a decent move and to get some space in a crowded penalty area. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. Hot news from Anfield, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Liverpool. 37 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. And we're back here again, thanks to Alan McAnally. He's given it away. He's gone short with it. Must take the lead here. Well, they have cleared the danger. It was a decent opportunity, I think. Indeedy. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Strong tackle to break up the play. It's a good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. The referee has indicated the referee has decided to add on two minutes. Two minutes. Two minutes. So here we are at half time and it's Referee just checking everything is in order, and he blows for the second half to start. Well, let's hear from Alan McAnally, who's got a goal to tell us about at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. It's a second goal for Manchester City. 49 minutes played, 2-1. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. Excellent attacking play here. They could open up the opposition now. Tackle is strong. Much more action to come, of course, on EA TV. Our presentation of the quarter-final first leg Champions League fixture. Next up for Middlesbrough, they'll be facing Liverpool away from home. Yeah. Trying to slip it through. Can't get the shot through. Good block. Corner played in. Well, that's a comfortable save for the keeper from the header. Well, it's not the most powerful header you'll see this season or even in this match didn't time it good vision that was a chance really of getting into a scoring position then but anything but it's good work here in terms of possession can they find the final pass well we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes half an hour to go here's Grant by the keeper he can't hang on to the ball we can hear now from Alan McAnally at Vicarage Road and there's been a goal Alan it's a third goal for Watford 64 minutes played 3-0 thanks Alan very good attack broken up in the end by good defensive play Lima Ben Yedder Arsenal give it away. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Into the attacking third. Got his laces behind that one. Took his eye off the ball, but not a bad effort. It's 
Read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Not oh, very easy for the goalkeeper there. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Nicola Pepe. And here's a chance for Arsenal. Pushed out by the goalkeeper, but only into a dangerous area. It's been one of those matches, Martin, you haven't been able to take your eyes off it because uh, if you were to look away, you'd miss yet another chance. We well, took a risk there, sliding in with that challenge in the penalty area. Arsenal are going to make a switch. Jose Maria Jimenez. Dumfries at Selhurst Park today with news of a goal is Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Everton. Seven minutes remain. 2 1. Great to have Alan McAnally out and about for us. And he's brought us right up to date again there. An incisive pass. Disappointed that that didn't lead to more. And this is going to be a throw. Arsenal with the substitution. Here's Haji. He's got that, but got the ball away as well. And no one's picking him up in the wide area. This could be dangerous. Arsenal, the Gunners, trying to find one last attacking weapon to hit the target. Nicola Pepe. Opportunity to play it into the middle. And that is the final whistle from the referee. The teams are level here.